Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got some really exciting news from System76. They've just released the Cosmic Beta desktop environment along with the Pop OS 24.04 LTS Beta. Yeah, this is a big step forward, so let's dive right into what's new. So it's been more than a year since System76 started uh, working on this Rust-based desktop. And after seven alphas, we finally have a beta version ready for public testing. The star of the show here is definitely the Cosmic Launcher. It lets you launch and navigate apps super quickly. And it's got some neat extras like web search, a calculator, and even file search built right in. And the Cosmic Files Manager, this one's been massively improved. Now it supports gallery mode for images, instant search, breadcrumbs with uh, autocomplete file previews, file permissions, uh, and even an adaptive design. Basically, it feels a lot more modern and polished. On top of that, Cosmic Beta gives you both single panel and dual panel layouts, advanced window tiling and stacking, plus fresh theming options. And yes, workspaces are still here. Now, speaking of apps, Cosmic Beta comes with its own lineup of defaults. Cosmic Settings, Cosmic Files, Cosmic Store, Cosmic Terminal, Cosmic Edit, and Cosmic Player. So yeah, they're moving away from GNOME apps and replacing them with their own COSMIC branded versions. For example, Cosmic Files replaces Nautilus, Cosmic Terminal replaces Gnome Terminal, and Cosmic Store replaces Pop Shop. Under the hood, Pop OS 24.04 LTS Beta is running the Linux 6.16 kernel, the Mesa 25.1.5 graphics stack, and the NVIDIA 580 driver for those of you on NVIDIA GPUs. It's based on Ubuntu 24.04 LTS, also known as Noble Numbat. System76 also mentioned that development is pretty straightforward on Cosmic, They've got solid documentation plus templates for apps and applets, so developers can easily package their software and make use of Cosmic's features. If you want to give this a spin, you can download the Pop OS 24.04 LTS beta for Intel slash AMD or NVIDIA systems directly from the official website. But hey, just a word of caution, both Cosmic and Pop OS 24.04 are still in beta. So don't install them on your main machine unless you're okay with a few bugs. So yeah, that's the latest from System76 and the Cosmic Desktop. Honestly, I'm really curious to see how this evolves toward the final release. What do you think? Is Cosmic ready to compete with GNOME and KDE or does it still have a long way to go? Drop your thoughts down in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more Linux news and updates. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.